morning peeps. We're on day four. Day four. Ready for the question? In the UK, what do well-behaved kids get in their stockings? I like that one. Are you ready? It's morning and it's cold today. It's really cold. Oh, this morning I got Roma. It's not cold. Okay, so we have to start with chocolate. That's a must. Four, 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 four. And we're over here. You'd think this would be easier. I'm gonna um, read before I take the chocolate. So this time you can actually understand me. It says, and mama in her kerchief and I in my cap had just settled our brains for a long winter's nap. Is that what it says normally? Our brains? I thought it said it had just settled down for a long winter's nap. It's, so this says brains. Y'all have to tell me. I don't have that book anymore because I can't carry around stuff. Oh, it's an ice skate. I used to ice skate. I loved it. What do you think? What do you think? Hmm. Yeah, it's a good one. Hmm. Ice skates taste yummy. <laughs> okay. Puka. Day four. It's way down here. English breakfast tea. <sighs> Sorry. Fall allergies. It's rude. Um, this one does have caffeine. It says a very exquisite blend of the very finest black teas. Somebody was telling me they love this, so I will try it, but it has to be early, early, early in the morning. Because um, since I stay away from caffeine, if I do drink it, I will be up all night. So it says it's a black tea blend of Puthar Horadors, De Jarling, and Late Flush. And Penskahala. Okay, it's beyond my um, capability of, but at some point I will try this when I'm up early. Because I have never tried an English tea. Maybe y'all can tell me if it's any good. Okay, we are on to Sephora. Day four. It's missing. Oh, I don't know. I should look these up before I start this. Oh, here it is right here. Day four. Ooh. It is Sephora Colorful Shimmer. Does it say that it just says colorful shimmer? The color is number 257, no place like home. No, it doesn't look, and the camera doesn't look, it looks sort of pink and it's kind of pretty. That's nice. At least it's makeup or something thereof. Last time was washi tape. Washi tape was weird to me. Okay, my chocolate's gone. Wash my palette out. That's hot. And we're on to this one. Four. I thought they were all going to be in the same place, but they're not. 
phone. It's up here. We're going to take one of the shepherd's faces. And we're going to read. Are you ready? Then the angel said to her, Do not be afraid, Mary, for you have found favor with God. Luke 1.30. That's pretty cool. We're going down through Luke. And, ooh, it's a hat today. A stocking hat, like a Santa stocking hat. Yeah. I like it. Stocking hats taste good, too. Okay, last one is the mini brands. <laughs> Four. Down here in the corner. Hey, they at least gave me a pink one. This is a Mentos. And it's the pink one. Yay. I, um, I prefer pink just because. Oh, this is awesome. My cart's going to be overflowing. Mmm, yeah, I'm unhappy this morning. Chocolate and Roma. Oh, yeah. With a hint of hazelnut creamer. Mmm. It's beginning to look a lot like Christmas. <coughs> oh, excuse me. Okay, number four. Are you ready? The question was, in the UK, what do well-behaved kids get in their stockings? The answer is tangerines. Yes. I love tangerines. I don't know if you were watching, but when I was doing the Halloween-y kind of thing, we used to go trick-or-treating to my great-grandmother's house, and she gave apples. Now, if she would have gave tangerines, I would have been in seventh heaven. I like apples, but tangerines, mwah. Yeah, okay. Y'all didn't care. TMI, TMI! <laughs> that was it, peeps. I hope you're having a wonderful, wonderful week and a full amazing day. Stay blessed. Until next time.